Our saint of the week is Saint Benjamin. Saint Benjamin was born in 329 AD in Iran. It was the 5th century and Yezdegerd, son of Sapor III, was ruling Persia. There was little persecution of Christians during this time. However, a Christian bishop named Abdas changed that. Abdas, in his zeal and out of righteous anger towards idolatry, burnt the temple of fire, the sacred sanctuary of the Persians. This act infuriated King Yezdegerd, and he declared that Bishop Abdas would either rebuild the Persian temple or the king would burn all the Christian churches. Abdas refused, stating that he could not partake in such profanity. During these times, Christians were subjected to extreme torture, and Benjamin was unfortunately one of those imprisoned for his Christian faith. The torture was so inhuman, and examples of some of the torturing methods include flaying of skins and backs. Sometimes the skins of the head were stripped. Benjamin, who was a deacon, was imprisoned for a year, and the Eastern Roman Emperor Theodosius II, through the ambassador, facilitated his release. The ambassador agreed on Benjamin's behalf that he would be released on the condition that he would abandon preaching and speaking about Christian religion. Benjamin, on the other hand, did not agree, and he strongly believed that it was his duty to evangelize and tell others about Christ. He continued to preach, which resulted in him being arrested again, and he was brought before the king. The emperor then ordered that St. Benjamin be tortured. This was after he had asked St. Benjamin to deny him whom he worshipped, and St. Benjamin assertively refused. Reeds were struck under his nails, both on the toes and fingers, and they were drawn. The process was repeated with violence. The reeds were also inserted into some of his tender parts. A knotty stick was also thrust into his bowels, resulting in the tearing of his internal organs. And this was the final straw that resulted in him becoming a martyr for his Christian faith in the year 424 AD. He showed Christians that no matter how much pain they endured, they must continue proclaiming the gospel. Benjamin's feast day is celebrated on the 31st of March. He is known as a patron saint of preachers. And so we say, Saint Benjamin, pray for us.